We were treated to an exciting day of college football in Champaign-Urbana, Illinois, as the Fighting Illini hold off the Ball State Cardinals 24-21. With Jay Lehman, I'm Chris Denary. I mean, we had everything you could ask for on this opening Saturday of college football. And for a young football team like Illinois, it's exactly what Lovey Smith wanted. They were tested, turnovers, momentum, Ball State attacking back, then Illinois fighting back. It's exactly what you want for a young football team and a win. Now, when you look at the numbers, you will seem hard pressed to see how Illinois actually won the game. Ball State dominated total yards 375 to 216. Look at the second half totals, 249 yards to 76. But Illinois brought back Mike Dudek for the first time in three years, and he was a difference maker. Yeah, Mike Dudek was the difference. Of course, they won the turnover battle as well, two to one. But it was Mikey Dudek and the spark and energy that he brought that was dynamic for the Illini. You know, they got to start off early, hitting Dudek. His first catch after three years without playing, touchdown for Dudek and then special teams. This was a huge play, Chris. This was a 52-yard punt return late in the fourth quarter that flipped the field from a 21-16 deficit. This would lead to a touchdown. Mike Epstein, the freshman, would score for the second time. Illinois, the two-point conversion. They led 24-21, and that set the stage for the final seconds. This was the two-point conversion. Chase Crouch, 24-21. Ball State had a chance to tie a field goal blocked at the horn. Blocked at the horn, and if you're Illinois, to win late like that with a young team big, and what do you think Levy Smith thought about it? I think Levy Smith loved it. Yeah, a lot of emotion from Lovey Smith this week. He has a young team he's excited about, and for the 20th straight time in the home opener, Illinois wins at Memorial Stadium. They beat Ball State 24-21.